ladies and bromosexuals, this is GarOTD23. I hope you are all enjoying the new sidebar because I did a lot of work on it. Um, also had to cut off, uh, I figured I'd cut off the sides for this because uh, I have a sidebar displaying our Pokemon, so, you know, why not? And then, uh, basically, uh, you guys, I believe Osantax told me to make the screen bigger, so... I just messed with the, the dimensions, and this is what we came up with. Also, uh, today, a new RU team. As you can see, I was looking at, a, I think it was Ryukard's video, um, where he does, like, the, uh, basically just Pokemon sets that uh, viewers of his channel sub uh, submit to him, and then showcase Clefable, and I was like, well, I do like me some Clefable. So, uh, I'm not going to spoil it set. But I have on Amoogus, um, basically Lefties, uh, Clear Smog, uh, what is it, Clear Smog, okay, basic, basic Amoogus with Regenerator, uh, my Dustmore is my physical wall, but also has really high special defense, um, uh, then I have the basic Typhlosion Choice Specs, cause he likes to wear the glasses, uh, then the Feraligator is my physical truck with Swords Dance, and then of course, got Goldberg the Steelix with the Hazards and the Roars, so let's uh, first on his side is basically just his regenerator core and his tank growth. His, his team is very defensive and it's probably just meant to showcase the Almastar. So let's go ahead and get into it right now. Um, I'm going to lead off with You Wish because she does wish. And uh, he's going to lead off with his Clefable, go for the Calm Mind. Now, uh, you're about to see what Clefable does. He's going to go for the, or she's going to go for Swagger, excuse me. It's a beautiful little girl. Uh, and Psycho. So I just copied all of his stats and with the unaware ability, all of his stat boosts I get to ignore so and then I also have body slam that way I can get some parafusion uh, hacks going on so and uh, he apparently has unaware as well because I'm not doing you know a two hit KO on him like it should be or something like that some kind of crazy amount of damage uh, but that's perfectly fine because he's getting paralyzed he's getting confused and at this point I should have uh, gotten up to plus six with my own um, you no know, psych ups, but I just decided, you know, I want to play it safe. I want to showcase Clefable for you guys. Uh, this set uh, that I found for, with Ryu card. He's going to, you know, take out. So that's one poke down. Brings in the Amoongus. Of course, same strategy uh, goes to hand. Uh, swagger it up. Uh, he's going to go for the Spore, which is fine. I had to apologize to him about the hacks. <laughs> But, you know, and uh, he's gonna go for foul play. I've never seen foul play on an Amoongus, but you know, whatever. I, I finally wake up, brings in the Tangrowth, which is, you know, a defensive wall if there ever was one. I miss a Swagger here as he misses a Focus Blast, which is fine because I have plus one special defense thanks to his Clefable <laughs> that I copied. But I get the, the Swagger there, um, get the um, Body Slam going on. Amoongus comes back in. He easily is to get KO'd by this. But, uh, you know, with his Regenerator, um, I went for the Swagger again. I don't know what he was trying to do. I guess he thought I was gonna... I don't know, but he switched out there. Uh, swagger him up again. Get the pair of hats. Go ahead and, and slam him to the ground right quick. Then the Cryogonal comes in. He's trying to Ice Beam me. I've got plus one special defense. It doesn't matter if you're Life Orb. I can Swagger you, and then I can Wish up, get my health back, and then I can commence slamming you to the ground. And then I go for a third Swagger. And this is where I mess up my Sweep. Because, uh, no, no, that's not it. But I, you know, he kills himself with the swagger because he's at plus three. Uh, so basically, I swagger the slow king as it comes in. So that's three pokes down with one cafe ball. It's looking like a 6 0 so far. Uh, swagger him up to plus three. He's, you know, does a big quarter of health out of his damage. And here I go for the psych up, and I'm like, ah, oh, why did you switch? Uh, gets to heal up with the generator, but. At this point, I spend a little bit of the battle uh, as he hydro pumps me, trying to <clears throat> basically psych up again. So, but since he did the hydro pump, I went for the wish. That way, I could have my health back. He's bringing in the Moongus, and I'm like, "You're gonna be confused and swaggered, you know." Uh, and then I get my plus two back, so I'm like, "Yes, I don't have to, you know, give up my sweep." So, I'm at plus two. I don't have the, you know, special. Uh, Defense increase, but that's fine. I can deal with that. He's gonna go for Giga Drain. That's fine because I two hit you at plus two with Body Slam. Uh, but he's gonna switch out, get that Regenerator going. I'm going for Body Slam. Does 45, so I can't two hit the Slow King, but I can if he hits himself with Confusion. I miss the Swagger again. He gets a big crit with the with the Psychic, 
uh, a big one. So I'm like, I uh, don't want to chance it. I'd rather just get some more damage on you because you have your regenerator core still. As you, as you see, he goes to the Moongus. So I get my rocks up that way. He's not switching in completely for free. As he spores me, which is perfectly fine because Felix, there's nothing he can really do here. Uh, even though I love him. Uh, <laughs> uh, Giga Drain, I, I've stayed in purposely because I thought he was going to go for the Stun Spore. However, he doesn't. So he, he then goes for the growth, attempting to, uh, I guess, kill my Steelix, but I was not going to let that happen as I uh, switch into my Noir to uh, try and, well, it was going to miss the first turn. Of course, I missed the first one. Um, and then goes for foul play. But I've got the pain split, so I got my life back. Even though he's going for Giga Drain, he's taking about a quarter health. There's nothing he can do because my my thesis was to burn his regenerator core that way he'll take rock damage and he'll take the burn damage. Go for the fire punch there because I didn't you know expect him to switch. I should have, but I didn't. But I get to burn the slow king, which is like I just told you five seconds ago my plan. So uh, Noir is basically walling his core, which is amazing because uh, you know who knew. <laughs> but Dust Noir is a complete beast apparently. So. Uh, that's what I'm doing. So he's got both of his walls are burned, so he's gonna take 13 with rocks. Then I'm gonna also hit him with, you know, earthquakes or the uh, super effective fire punch, and then the burn. So he's gonna be able to take out two, both of his. My defensive wall is gonna be able to take out his regenerator core single handedly. And pain split for the uh, fucking recovery is ridiculous. I love it. Uh, so I got rid of the Amoongus. He's gonna bring in the Amistar, and I'm like, uh, I'm burning you, but he's faster than me. So I'm like, well, I guess I'm not burning you. So, uh, my, my thing here was put it to sleep so it can't uh, shell smash. Just put it to sleep and get it over with. But uh, he, he brings me the Slow King and I outspeed, go for the Giga Dream, take out that big threat. Uh, actually, a small threat because it's defensive or whatever. It was a threat to me. It's got a big ass crown on. And then the Giga Dream comes through as swag as the Amoongus takes out the threat of Alpha Star. So, yeah, look, look at I didn't even get to showcase my actual, like, attacking Pokemon. Like, uh, Amoongus and Dusnor, my walls, did all the work there. And then Clefable, of course, putting bodies on the ground. What, that's what Fable does. Plus body on the ground. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, also, tell me what you guys think about the new sidebar, the new dimensions, about how I blew up the screen like a madman. And uh, if you have any suggestions for my team, let me know because I did change, after this, I changed uh, Celix to Crustle with Spikes, uh, Rocks, Earthquake, or not Earthquake, Stone Age, and Excisor. So, uh, what's your favorite OU, or not OU, are you Pope? Because I'm thinking mine is either Typhlosion or for Alligator. Or Steelix, because Steelix is the beast, and uh, I can't decide, so you guys gotta help me. Also, make sure you leave a like, because I know you enjoyed it, and then subscribe, because then you'll get more cookies every day. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.